Welcome back to Survival Fountain of Youth, and I am back here at the Island of Hope, my home base. I just did a bunch of resource gathering, uh, brought a bunch of iron back here, smelted it, made some new stuff. I got an iron axe, an iron knife, and um, I made an Indian diving mask with... Um, some manta ray leather that I got. Uh, I also upgraded my boots. I'm now using leather boots with copper plates. Uh, I wasn't able to upgrade anything else, any of my other armor, because I ran out of copper. So, uh, yeah, the copper is not respawning very quickly. The resources respawn quite slowly. In this game. But I am ready to sail back to Iron Island, but actually there's some other stuff around here I want to check out. There's a shipwreck and another island over here. The, uh, this here, I believe, is the Sulphur Island to the southwest of Iron Island. But we're going to kind of sail around to the north and east of Iron Island, explore that area before we get to Sulphur Island. See if we can find some good loot. Alright, we're here. And I'm going to head north east. Actually, let's head north to this scrap of land. I guess there's an iron tree there. Let's uh, explore it. I just want to map everything. Oh man, we got to be careful here. My um, my ship can take damage if I turn too sharply and hit a rock or something. All right, is this the iron tree? I think it is. I'll take it. Uh, there could be something up there, too. Let's see if I can get up there and... I'll start mapping. That looks like a high point. I could have just mapped from... my ship. Oh, yeah, I don't know if we're going to be able to get up there. Well, not from here, anyway. No. So close. There we go.
Okay, that might be as high as I'm gonna get. Looks like there's a cave in there. That's interesting. Let's, um... Map this area. I'm falling. Oh, wait. There's a Puma potion. Edo. Apparently, I was falling. Okay, let's get... Okay, I think that's okay. Alright, there we go. Iron tree branch. Yep, and then what's over there? Bird's nest and a cave. Doesn't look like there's anything in it. Not that I can see. Check it out. Ship box. No, nothing there. Yeah, there's a wrecked ship. in there. Looks like a good spot to set up camp, but otherwise pretty empty. There's my ship. Thought I lost it for a second. Okay, now to the east. We're gonna check out this shipwreck here. Yeah, I think I see it. I see the the mast there sticking out. I think that's what it is. All right, let's uh, s scout the area. No, 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 go back up. Let's map the area from up here. No, stay still. What are you doing? My movement is wonky. I guess the ship is... rocking back and forth. Um, can't map the area. Why can't I map the area? Island map unavailable. Mm, okay. Yep, I guess... Um, we're just going in. Probably a shark down there. Well, uh, let's get our harpoon ready. Okay, I don't see a shark. Coral powder, copper nails.
Uh, two bar doors. Oh, there's the other half of the ship. Here, let's um let's put on our rebreather thing. Our what do you call it? Indian diving mask. Let's give that a try. Okay. Set of tools. Nice. Is that it? Anything else? Get in here? No? Ow. Dang jellyfish. Ow. No. Die. Okay, where is the other half of that ship? Right here. More barred doors. Found a piece of leather. What else we got? Oh, my stamina is running out. There's manta rays down there. They're not very dangerous, though. Why am I overburdened? What did I pick up? Oh, it's all the branches, right? Okay. Alright, we're good. Thing. Get it in here. There's uh, rations, bag of provisions, and tools. There we go. That's what I wanted. Okay, I think that's it. Does it say how many tools there are in this area? Sets of tools, two of two. Yep, that's it. Okay, now to the southeast.
to this little island. Probably nothing there, but... I'd like to uh, have it explored anyway. Map it out. Alright, now let's see if we can map this out from up here. Um, yeah, at least this island we can. Not much there. No. For some reason, I keep falling off. Not sure what's going on there. Okay. Yeah, I can't map too much from this height, but it's better than nothing. to next. Um, land on Foggy Island. Jose de Ruz was sent on the Foggy Island. He may know what happened to the rest of the crew. But which one is the foggy island? Two islands. One, I thought one was like a sulfur island. This one. And then this, maybe this is the foggy island. Okay, I'm going to try to head to what I think is where they went to find sulfur. Which is right here. Okay, that's Craggy Island. Let's uh, keep going. See what this island's called. Location unlocked. What is this? Foggy Island. Okay. It is foggy. Gonna make it tough to find a good place to land. To dock. Um... 
Okay. I see a light. It's a bit tricky to navigate through here. Yeah, there's a busted up ship right here. Somebody's angry with me. What the heck? Is that a bat? How dare you? This might be a good opportunity to, uh... Well, maybe I can dodge them. I never tried dodging the bats with the right mouse button. Maybe I can do that. I was going to say, it might be a good opportunity to try my bow and arrow, which I've never actually used yet. Can I get closer without damaging my boat? I can. I don't want to jump in the water. Okay, I'm on Foggy Island. And what happened here? Let's put our leather hood back on. I'll take these tendon threads. They're good to have. And here is a Portuguese ship's log. Uh, April 24th, the God's favorite Caraco... Uh, Caraca, Captain Vimira Ribeiro. I don't know what a Caraca is. The expedition is close to finishing. If the navigator is right, a huge formation of islands must be somewhere near. I will call these lands New Portugal, and they will become a diamond in the crown of His Majesty John I. April 26. The fog is thickening. Sailors say there was a sound similar to a horn. Just in case, I order the rum supply to be cut off for the next two days. April 27th, the sound of a horn in the fog is clearly audible now. Could it be that we're approaching inhabited lands? April 28th, there is land ahead. Looks like an island. April 29th, there's no way to reach the shore by ship in such a fog. I, along with several people, will disembark on a boat in order to hoist the flag of Portugal and declare this land the property of the Portuguese crown. April 30th, we've been severed from the world. Right after we disembarked, a terrible storm came. God's favorite was smashed against the coastal rocks. Remains of it washed ashore. Now only 16 of us are left. God help us. May 2nd, this foggy island is quite a graveyard of ships. Looks like we are far from being the first ones shipwrecked here. Unfortunately... Uh, these wrecks are a good place to settle settle down. May 3rd, two sailors are missing. The rest are whispering that someone was walking around the camp last night. The horn still sounds from the heart of the island. Just in case, we will strengthen the guard. 
May 4th, three more sailors are missing. The footsteps in the fog are now heard by everyone. The horn keeps blowing too. We will go to that sound tomorrow to find out who's kidnapping our people. Written by another person. May 6th. Captain is missing. Everevan is missing. They left me to watch the camp and left to the sound. Never came back. Someone walks in the fog. I sailor Miguel of Brondoa, the last survivor. Well, he went crazy. So there's a horn sound. Oh, it's nighttime. I gotta sleep. There's apparently some kind of a uh, horn noise coming from inland a little bit. Let's uh, finish exploring the ship, grabbing these tendon threads. Let's start mapping the island. Okay, we got obsidian. Don't really care about that. Yeah, there's a bunch of wrecked ships here. Nice. I don't see anything in there. Yeah, I don't think any... Any more of the ship is accessible. Okay. Let's explore this place. Looks like that ship has been here a while. It's buried deep. Hey, guys. There's a big ship. Looks like it's been been here a while as well.
Ow. I don't know. I don't hear any horns. Oh no. Bats. Ha 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 ha. Perfect. I gotta get my arrow back, if I can. Alright, let's check out that ship over here. This looks a bit more intact, it might be a more recent wreckage. French ship's log. January 4th, 1230. Captain Edmund Duferand Cog the Montsegur. The Lord is kind to us and there was no winter in this land. The last time we saw snow was last winter. Back home in Tulo. But now, for cathers like us, there's nothing but, but the fires of Inquisition. But the Lord didn't leave us, and we believe that we will find new land where we will build a new state according to his commandments. January 5th, the fog around the ship mutes sounds, but Reverend Jules prays hard for the Lord to see us through the fog. January 6th, the Lord gave us a sign. We heard the sound of a horn in the fog. God's angels have blown it to us to show the way. January 7th, a terrible shipwreck took several lives. We have lost our ship, but we have gained our land. Clearly, the Lord wants us to stay here and never go back to France. To a France drowned in the Pope's heresy. Well, this guy is optimistic. Uh, January 8th. This island is littered with shipwrecks. Reverend Jewel says that the Lord took the ships away from those who arrived here because their journey is finished. We wanted to proceed deeper into the island, but the people are too tired and the fog is still not cleared. January 9th. After the morning prayer, we found that Denise vanished. Or Denis. Reverend Jules said that he had heard... Um... Reverend Jewel said that he had heard the steps of God's messenger in the night. Maybe he took the knee at his most righteous of us, as the most righteous of us. The rest are not ready to see, his, to see his face yet. January 9th, God's angels blew the horn again. This is a call and we will go to it. January 12th, what we have found cannot be done by human hands. The devil deceived us. This island is his place palace and his fiefdom having knocked us astray in the fog he beckoned us with the sound of a horn and we went there well not so optimistic all of a sudden i wonder what happened the lord tried to stop us by wrecking our ship but we did not heed his sign and now one by one the devil takes us walking around in the fog like a wolf around the herd january 13th May I be strong in my faith. May I be strong in my faith. He's dead. 
Oh, a shit bed. Neato. Well, I don't need to sleep, but that's cool. So the French arrived here first. Ah, there's a skeleton. Hello, skeleton. No diary, no nothing. Okay. snack there. There's a bunch of nests, but no birds. Not complaining, though. Living water. There we go. Alright, this might be a good spot to map That might be a shipwreck right there. Maybe just rocks. Let's have a look. Uh, no, that's just rocks. Alright, interesting. Well, uh, there's a ship right there I gotta explore. A uh, lot of shipwrecks here on Foggy Island. We gotta find out where the engineers went. Alright, I'm gonna end it here, and next time we'll continue exploring Foggy Island. Find out what happened here. Alright, see you next time.